What is up you guys? Today celebrates me of being on YouTube for a whole entire year. Uncle <laughs> wanted to do this intro with me. He's being very sassy today. Aren't you little baby? So yeah, let's get started with this Q&A. Come on little baby, I love you. <laughs> this whole entire video can't be about you though. I'm sorry. Mm, you're so cute. So you guys are gonna probably end up seeing this and I was gonna save it for later, but we had a new baby born and hi my love. Hi. I love you so much. Hi. Guys, that's awkward little baby. He has another little child. You're so cute. Um yeah, so I was gonna save that for later, but she's gonna be popping in and out and she's buying like crazy. Alright, first question is would you want to take care of an exotic animal such as a giraffe? So, personally, I feel that animals like giraffes, elephants, stuff like that, I feel like they should just be kept out in the wild, um, not like in the circus or whatever. So, personally, I don't think I ever would. I always joke about getting an ostrich, but that'll never happen. All right, next one. Do you play any instruments? Yeah, I do. I play trombone. I don't really like it, but yeah, I guess I can play an instrument. What is your dream animal at the moment? Probably, oh my gosh, I really want like a baby miniature donkey. Like especially if I had a bottle feed it, I'm just like obsessed with bottle feeding animals. Cause like they turn out to be so nice and it's so cute. Um, so yeah, probably a miniature donkey. All right, which accent do you speak? I speak Australian, I'm just kidding. <laughs> That'd be so cool if I did. Um, I guess English, I don't know. All right. How do you manage school life and farm life? So, I'm going to be honest, I'm probably one of like the busiest kids you'd ever meet. I'll like try and make a picture and put it up here of like what my week looks like, but I'd say like Saturday and Sunday are my two break days. Like I still do chores and work on the farm here every single day. It doesn't matter if it's Christmas or the weekends, it's every single day. Um, and so I'd say like Monday I don't have anything like I can't do anything because I have wake up chores school and then after tr and then after school it's track and then my dad picks me up from track and drives me all the way to ninja and then we get home from ninja at like nine o'clock and then I go to sleep so Monday's like shot I can't do anything there and then Tuesday I have school track and then when I get home I try to film and I consider that to be like a job or like a task that I have to do and then Wednesday it would be um, wake up chores school track confirmation maybe get like an hour of trying to like edit or do filming and then Thursday I would try and have my whole entire video edited and I would still have you know all school track um, and then I try to have to upload it because Friday I have to post it and so then it would be Friday school chores track um, and then upload my video and then that's why I say Saturday and Sunday are kind of like my break days <laughs> and that's when I get to just spend time with my animals and just like kind of take a break from everything. Um, it is like a lot of work but I'm pretty strong mentally um, and I love doing it so it's all worth it. Alright, do you want to keep your farm when you're older? So I definitely do want to live on a farm when I'm older. I don't know about like this exact one. Um, and I know that there's another question of like, were you born into farm life or did you like have it or like get into it at a different time in your life? I was born into it, okay? Like my dad grew up on this farm. I think it's my great, great grandpa's farm. So like fifth generation, like, yeah. So I was definitely born into it. I don't know about this exact one, but also saying like fifth generation, I don't know, I might want to keep it. But it also depends, because, like, I want a ranch when I grow up, okay? And that was another one, like, what are your plans for the future? I want to, like, okay, so I'm going to get, <laughs> oh my gosh, okay, I love this, okay. So, I'm going to get done with high school, and then I'm going to go into the military, either Marines, Army, I don't know about those two yet. Um, and I want to be in the medical field there, I want to be a medic. And then after that, I want to, like, make a living off of farm life. And so, I want to buy, like, we have 160 acres here, and I feel like I'd outgrow that. <laughs> and so, like, I either want to live on, I really want to try and get into dairy farming. I think that is so cool. Like, no one in my family has done that. And so, like, I know it's, like, really hard to figure out and stuff, but I just love, like, making schedules and planning stuff and I know that like you have to do a lot with that and also whenever you go to a cow auction 
80% of the cows are dairy cows, and so like I could be buying a lot of cows. Um, but yeah, those are like my real dreams, and also I want to raise up my kids like the way I was raised, and so like I want to have them be able to have like sheepies if they want to. Obviously, you know, have to have all the responsibilities that I have too. But like I would have like the business side of farming and also like the fun side of farming where you can have sheep and you can be bottle feeding them and have rabbits and pigs if you want to. Um, and so I'm just hoping that I'm fortunate enough to have all that um, when I'm older and at the end of the day it's all in God's hands. So that was another question. What's your religion if you have one? Alright, sorry guys, I had to take a break. The baby's coming all over me. Um, but every single night I'm praying for my animals to stay healthy and stuff. Um, just a couple days ago we weren't getting any rain. Or not a couple days ago, it was like weeks we were not getting any rain. Um, and everything was dying. And so I was praying about that and stuff. Um, and for those of you that don't believe in God, I just want to say a lot of miracles that happen on this farm are because of God and me praying and asking for them. And if you want to get into Christianity or if you want to get into having a belief in God, instead of praying like, please make me get first in this ninja competition tomorrow, it's just like, please give me my highest capability that I can ever have when I'm running this course. And if that means I time out, but if I tried my hardest, I'm happy about that. Or just please give me a sharp and focused mind to do that. And so, I don't want to make this whole entire thing in like five minutes. But yeah, I do believe in God a lot. Alright you guys, so I always like to dress up little baby up for. And normally he likes to be dressed up. He's been a little cranky today. Um, but we're going to see how it goes. So, for his birthday, I had gotten him the... Oh yeah, he's already running away. I got him this. And I got him this cute little socks and so I'm going to try and put them on him because it's always so cute whenever he has clothes on him. Alright, are we going to try this here little baby? Oh, you're so cute. I love you. Oh, look at the little baby. I love you so much. Okay, now it's time to put on his little socks. And oh, Akbar. Baby, you're too big to lay on mommy's lap. You little baby. I love you so much. You're so cute. Okay, ready? I love you so much. Oh, you did so good. He still has it on. Oh, you're so cute, my little baby. You're so cute. You guys, look at how cute Akbar is. I got both socks on him. Hi. All right, so I just want to take a minute to say thank you to you guys, the viewers, because this literally happened all because of you guys. I would have quit a long time ago if no one was watching my channel or anything. So I just want to say thank you guys, and whenever you guys comment such nice things, it brightens up my day a lot. And so I just want to say thank you guys so much for watching my videos. Um, so yeah, just thank you a lot. Hey guys, hope you enjoyed the video. Don't forget to subscribe to the friends. Stay cringy, and I will see you in the next one. Bye.